Welcome back to part three of Scions of Vega. We last left off leaving outside of a cave back that way where we got a key and another cryptic message. Let's move forward, shall we? With bro, creepy bro. Whom we're not telling anything of what happened to us back there. A boot. The boat. But I believe there was a gate back this way. Right here. We have the key for it and we're able to move on. No and we got now. another achievement. We check out the chapel. Maybe the priest is there to explain to us what's going on. Born of fire. A field of flowers with some kind of tower in the distance. Not bad sight. There's a bridge ahead. You know, the chapel is not too far away after we cross it. We should push just a little more. Maybe we can reveal some secrets there. Maybe the priest will explain it all. I can't us. run anymore. I know you're not much on the religious side, and I understand that, but their God is not exactly what I have in my heart either. But anyhow, this is not our concern at the moment. After all, Lila must be all that matters to you, right? Yes, so let me run. Thank you. Cause this game would take forever if we were walking all over the place. We're almost there. Be honest, the chapel is not my favorite place in this terrain. But if we gotta go, we gotta go. And let's try to be nice to the priest while asking questions. He's connected, so he may know a thing or two. I don't think we're gonna be asking any questions. He's just gonna be telling us stuff. That's locked. Another gate. He could be in the backyard. There's a bunch of birds over there. Corpse. Why were they here? Graveyard. Of course, bro doesn't follow us back here. But here's a way in. You search inside. I'm here. Yeah, of course. Let me do all the work. But why do you have the door chained up? It's not even in here. Or maybe he is. Secret of priest. Priest is up to no good. What you got, priest? Are oh, you kidding me? Freaking lock. We got puzzles. This priest does not want to be found. So we got to look for something that might have a code on it. Let's go back. We got to go back. It's two, one, three, zero. It looks like, or two, one, three, eight. We found a code. Just gotta look around the surroundings. What do we got? Two, one, three, zero. That's the right one, right? Two, one, three.
Got it. We did it, but I can't move. Oh, now we can move. Hello? He's not in here. Some kind of chair. That's some, some kind of commotion. We got a key, though. All their members are young, but they show no mercy to the elders. Larry was the cult's first victim. They say he kneeled and begged for mercy, but they punished him, but they pushed him down to the floor. The, then they did what they did, and he's gone. It seems these beautiful lands are cursed. The devil himself rules around here, and he's making fatal subconscious control. If you are reading this note, it means that I, too, have been a victim of the scions of Vega cult, my child. It's a cult activity going on here. And we got the key. That's what's going on. What will our bro do? Will we let him know what happened? I doubt it. Nice code. Okay, let's go back outside. Oh, look at him. Waiting. Let's get out of here. This place is getting even more creepy. And I think I saw a gate. Over here. Nice. Well, shit. Haunting the chapel. We shouldn't give up at this point. Let's keep on moving. I'm right behind you. So we got through the haunting the chapel, the chapel section. Got another deer. Howard. These children, I envy them. They are pure and innocent. Being without their parents may be hard, but I can see the glow in their eyes. A glow so sure. strong as if the shiniest star granted them freedom. Even if there's I weird stuff going on, a part of me has peace. Seeing them as strong as they are. I see nothing but emptiness, hollow. No emotion. They're just there. Watch out for the bushes. They are tall and have thorns. This path up until the four houses is somewhat narrow. A couple weeks ago, I hurt myself on the neck. Going all the way up is a little tiring. But when you reach the top, the scenery is totally worth it. Especially when the sun sets and the bright starts begin to appear. This guy goes down this path quite often, it seems. All right, here are the four houses. You going? Nope. You going in that one? Any kids stranded? Oh yeah, there's another one. He looks horrible. Hey, buddy. Creepy. I think my father will return soon. He better. I already forgot everything about him. The cupboards are, are full of liquor, so he probably likes to drink. Do you like to drink, sir? This character could probably go for a drink right now. Okay. He let us in. So what's wrong in this house? Far, I don't see too much to interact with. Back door. Get the bathroom. Same painting as that other house. All right, nothing downstairs. Let's try going up. I mean, it's a nice setup for the most part for these houses. 
It's like country living a bit. So far, I'm not seeing much. I guess this is what we want. So it's two stars. One's in the water, one's in the sky. Around the mountains. So this is the kids' room. With a light that actually works. All right, can we move now? Yeah. Oh boy, huge squirrels. So what we got in here? Let's see what's over there. I'll wait here. Oh shit. What's in here? Oh, we can jump, huh? Again. Ah! Who thought jumping puzzles? We made it. We made it. Oh. What's that mean? Do we got to figure out a certain combo to open this door? I think we did it. Follow the light. <coughs> that was simple. Scotch makes me high, so right now I don't give a shit. As long as I'm jumping around the fluffy cribs and clouds, they can come and take me anywhere they want. All I know is that Oliver was fine gentlemen who didn't deserve him. Fuck off the rest. Even that black leg Larry. Even his prayers are fake. The only thing he believes in is thickness of his wallet. Only thing he believes in is the thickness of his wallet, if you ask me. That guy, Logan, I bet he has a stronger faith than all the residents here. God bless his kind soul. Give me the key. All right. They weren't kidding. Gonna be dealing with some keys in this one. Get back up here. Ladders do not work right for the most part. Hey, you. All right, we just got to find another gate. Yeah, we will be good to roll. But we came up from there. And this way, hopefully, yep. There's the gate. Done. Repentless. So... I would like to thank you for watching this part. Feel free to leave a like and or a comment. And if you're really feeling brave, leave a subscribe. Subscribe for more. And I will catch you in the next episode. Peace.